North Korea is located in East Asia in the northern half of the Korean Peninsula. North Korea shares a border with China along the Amnok River, which is right here, you know, and um, a border with South Korea along the Korean Demilitarized Zone, which is also known as the 38th Parallel, um, and a border with Russia along the Tumen River, which is up here. It's kind of out of the map. Um, the Korea Bay and Yellow Sea are just off the west coast, and that's right here. And off of the east coast, there's the Sea of Japan. And um, North Korea has many mountains and hills separated by deep, narrow valleys. And... Um, there are wide coastal plains found in the west, however these plains are not as present in the east. And about 80% of North Korea's land area is covered with mountains and uplands, and this can be seen in this little area right here with the higher elevation. And um, all the mountains have an elevation of 2,000 meters or more. North Korea's climate is best described as a cooler, humid continental climate. In the summer, it is warm, but the winter in this er winters in this area are cold and snowy. Korea is located in a temperate climate zone at a medium latitude. Because of this, it has four distinct seasons. Spring occurs from March to May, summer from June to August, autumn is from September to November, and winter is from December to February. The long winters bring cold, clear weather and with occasional snowstorms due to winds that blow from Siberia. In January, the temperatures are typically negative 3 degrees Celsius and negative 13 degrees Celsius. The average snowfall is approximately 37 days during the winter. Summer is typically short, hot, rainy, and humid because of the monsoon winds from the south that bring warm and moist air from the Pacific Ocean. In August, the temperatures are usually 29 degrees Celsius and 20 degrees Celsius. On average, 60% of all rainfall occurs from June to September. The natural forest in this area consists of needle-leaved and broad-leaved evergreens and broad-leaved deciduous trees, which those can be seen in this brown area all, all around here and down in here, in this area too. <laughs> and um, deciduous trees and evergreens are also found in a humid subtropical region. Um, bamboo grows abundantly in warmer areas of this region. Bamboo has many uses ranging from medicine, decoration, and food to construction of bridges, homes, and skyscrapers. Bamboo is also a food source for the giant panda and the red panda. The mulberry tree is also found here in North Korea, providing food for silkworms and the tea bush. Tea, silk, and bamboo are very important to the culture and economy of this region. North Korea is a low-developed country. They are a small country with not a lot of people. Their GDP per capita is 1,800. Their infant mortality rate is 27.11 deaths per 1,000 births. Their life expectancy is 86.89 years, and their HTI index is 0 0.733. Looking at their population pyramid, they don't have many older people but they do have many middle-aged adults and also not very many kids being born. On their population density map, most of the population is located near the coast, which is common for the imports and exports of the country. North Korea is ruled by Kim Jong-un. Their leadership has gone through many generations of their family. North Korea is a communist country and used to be joined with South Korea. But there were conflicts, and it caused a war to break out in 1950 to 1953. They divided into two countries, North Korea and South Korea. The U.S. doesn't like the way North Korea treats their people, so they don't have a friendly relationship.
For decades, North Korea has been one of the world's most secretive societies. Cultural dishes in North Korea include, but are not limited to, cold noodles. Um, it also includes duck meat, which is a popular meal. And um, rice cake, fish cake, and red chili sauce. As well as pat bing su, which is a traditional Korean dessert. Buddhism is the main religion in North Korea, and the teachings are seen in North in Korean lifestyle and culture and art. In North Korea, you can find many people enjoying football, golfing, bowling, and shooting. Breaking news, U.S. Ambassador Mark Lippert was slashed in the face with a fruit knife by a South Korean man that is said to have a history of erratic behavior. The attack took place during a breakfast forum in Central Seoul back in early March. The attack left Lippert with 80 stitches, nerve damage, and an injury to his arm. The attacker was not charged with any crimes related to North Korea, despite his multiple visits to the country. North Korea spoke on the matter, saying the attack was deserved punishment, but then denied it had anything to do with them. In a commentary posted Thursday, the committee wrote, Lipper needs to drop the bad habit of rashly engaging in scheming chatter, distorting the truth, and instigating war by taking issue with us. Otherwise, next time, he could face a bigger mishap than getting cut in the cheek by a South Korean citizen.